Welcome back to Lakeisha Loves to Plant. Today I'm excited. I am just coming on here to share with you my social media planner. How do I keep it all together? I do it here and here in this planner. I had one last year, but I repurposed this beautiful um Louis Vuitton uh, faux Louis. It's not a real Louis. Um, I actually got this planner from um, AliExpress for about $14. It took forever to come. As you know, if you order from AliExpress, they, it takes a long time to come. But this was worth it. And then I'm so proud of myself for making this beautiful charm with a C for my last name on it here with all of these white beads. I just absolutely love it. And the inside of this is just simply gorgeous, you all. It's pink. I had to set this up with pink stuff so I have my honeybee shop stickers here that are the same color as the planner and um, I have some honeybee shop um, uh, die cuts here and um, die cut stickers and then I have these beautiful um, clear stickies that are um, the same color that rose gold color that I think is just absolutely gorgeous here and then this is also um, the honeybee shop paper so I just set this up with one of my honeybee shop um, subscriptions and um, now I'm going to show you what I did so I didn't really have um, any inserts for this um, my sister who um, is not in the planner community but she knows I love I love planners. She gave me this beautiful planner and said she believed she could, so she did. But I needed the inserts. They were perfect A5 inserts. So I actually uncoiled all of the inserts from in here. And I'm saving this for what I don't know. I have to figure it out. But I uncoiled all the inserts out of here and I placed them into these rings. So I punched holes and placed them into these rings now this is an old dashboard that i just repurposed mess messy bun getting it done um because with social media hey that's how it is sometimes and so um i took that and then again just put this dashboard here from um the honeybee shop you got this and then also this beautiful paper here um this is um acetate is this acetate or vellum i want to say this is acetate it's acetate paper I think um, and then here is the insert from this planner so it's the same marble here but guess what I did oh I didn't even pu I punched holes a little bit to make it fit and but I used the actual holes from the coiling to do it here I don't know if you can see that I'm gonna bring it closer to you so you can see what I did see what I did so if you have a planner that is coiled and you want to use the inserts in your rings hey you can do that um, that's what I did and it's pretty much working out so this is 2021 so we are in January so I am going to decorate this spread really quickly and show you how I plan on using it so I'm gonna start with this week coming up which is this week right here so I am going to actually take this out I'm going to decorate these pages for this week and then I'm going to put it back in because this is the last week before February so I have to do my monthly eventually as well. So I hope you enjoyed those tips for how you can repurpose planners. I am uh, the type of person that I really do not like wasting money so um, any way that I can um, save money I will so um, I am going to start decorating this planner I have this beautiful um, washi tape from vinvanali.com um, hope love faith and I am also a PR person for vinvanali.com so you can use Lakeisha20 at vinvanali.com for 20% off um, but this actually I don't know if this is sold separately on the site but this actually came with a, um, a subscription that I had so I'm going to start laying this um, decoratively on each page um, that I am going to be um, uploading a video so my current schedule is that I'm going to upload a video on Monday uh, which is my passion planner Mondays 
I'm also going to be uploading videos this week. Um, sorry, on Wednesdays. So I'm going to put it down here. And my Wednesday videos, I call them Worship Wednesday because I'm always um, doing something with the Lord on Wednesday. So either I am decorating a planner or I'm Bible journaling or I'm working in my war binder. And then on Fridays, I'm going to put one here as well. On Fridays, I call these free Fridays. That means I can do what I want to do. It is a wild card free day. And I usually do fun stuff like hauls or like, um, another type of planner because I have a lot of planner but planners but honestly like I cannot put all show you all of my planners like I have so many planners y'all so I can't possibly show you and some of my planners I do not do all this decorating in so those are my three uploads during the week and then on Saturday um and this is I want to split this because this is actually two different days um on Saturday I do um, Success Saturdays, which is a live. Um, I am a certified life coach, and so I do a live life, life coaching hour here. And then on Sundays, I plan on doing replays. So I will be replaying one of my playlists. So that's basically my um, social media week. Monday, Wednesday, Friday, with Saturday, um, being live and then Sunday being a replay day. So I'm going to try that cadence of activity um, to see if that works. Now, on the days that I'm not going to be um, filming, I am going to be taking, I'm going to use those as like note pages. So I'm going to put these pins here and my dog, my dog is barking and uh, I hope you don't hear that. Uh, but I want to use these uh, pins on Tuesdays and Thursdays and actually Sundays too because Sundays I'm not really um I'm I'm batching so Sunday is also my planner day where I batch videos so I will be batching on that day and so I was going to um let's see I think I want to use these because these make sense because I, I do need the writing space, but I don't need the whole kit. So this is a Danny Faith um, design kit from DannyFaithDesigns.com. So I'm just going to use a couple of these in my notes areas just in case I need to make a list or I need to um, brainstorm any ideas. That's Tuesday. I'm also going to do one on Thursday. Okay. And then on Sunday, I'm batching videos. So I'm going to go ahead and place a list here so I can list um, the type of videos I'm batching. So as you can see, three days of filming. This is a live. And then three days of note taking. So that is how I'm setting up my... Um, uh, social media planner and then I have these beautiful stickers from 25 collection um, she's absolutely gorgeous so I'm going to put her somewhere she needs to go like somewhere um, let's put her let's put her um, here yeah that's nice so I like her. She just looks cute with her glasses on. And then um, let me see. I need something to symbolize that I'm doing a live. And this is the weekend, so I can use this. Um, I can use this weekend sign. It's the weekend. Cheers to the freaking weekend. And um. I can use this TV for going live. How about that? A TV can symbolize going live. And then... Um, I love these stickers. Aren't they pretty from Danny Faith? So I'm just going to use a couple of these. I have to use a coffee one. Because she's drinking coffee. So, you know, little coffee theme here. 
Um, so I want to place this one here. This is just for decoration purposes. And then um, shopping. Oh, yes. I have to put like a little shopping. I, I just love to shop. So I want to add that here. And then I'm going to add another one here for it just because it's a pattern. So I want to add this one, which is a makeup bag. Because I have to do my makeup when I do my... Um, when I do my videos and I fill my thumbnails like that okay so um, I think I'm going to use this up here to just to cover this is like a lot of white space up here so I'm just going to use this to cover up here oh not the holes oh wait I'm not using that hole though so I'm gonna cut, cut this up I'll cut this to fit Okay, and then I'm going to cut this to fit as well. So comment below if you have a social media planner and let me know how you use it and what are your like buckets of information. Like what do you record in them that makes sense for you? Let me know. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to now use these boxes here as, as titles for each day. So I can know each day what I'm doing. So there's seven days. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, I can use these. These are bigger. Yeah, I use these. So um, I'm just going to put these boxes here so I can signify um, each day what I'm doing. So, for example, like Monday is Passion Planner Monday. I can write that here and I can take notes. Tuesday, this is all a notes day. Um, I'm not going to wait to Tuesday to take notes there, though. Like, I'm going to um, just take notes there whenever I need to. Because I, I study social media, too. Like best practices and things like that and I, I do look at my data once a week and stuff like that so um, I want to make sure I do that and then this is where I do my lives okay so and I know I covered up the dates but I'm not worried about that um, because do we have Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday? No. I have plenty of like weekly things um, I have this sheet from Chrissy Ann Designs I really love this sheet but I don't know you all comment below if you know if Chrissy Ann Designs is um, discontinued I don't know if she's discontinued I don't know but I want to go here because here we go she has these big beautiful days of the week that I absolutely love so I'm going to use these and also her numbers or the days. Tuesday. Wait, is this really? yeah? Oh, I hate when that happens. I don't care. I'm just gonna leave it like that. Wednesday. I need to be using my. Why didn't y'all tell me to get my um my little um tools you know what I'm saying you got tools for a reason honey so I gotta use my little tweezers sister tweezers okay so um I love the way this turned out it's simple and easy that's what I want for my social media planner I do not want anything that is like just too over the top and I gotta record there I, I know there's a lot of like ready-made social media planners out there but I for social media I really don't need to record all of those things that I see on other planners so um, I just don't I just don't so now I'm going to um, use some numbers because this is the week of the 25th so um, let me do the numbers here and then this will wrap up the um, decor part of this and then I am going to do a little bit of writing in here so if you have always already been thinking about like getting a social media planner 
and you don't know what to do, you don't understand it. There are so many resources out there, y'all. I know a happy planner has a social media planner. I believe, does Recollections have a social? No, regulations might have a social media plan. And I know there's some independent shops that have um, social media planners as well. Um, so there's a variety of things out there. But hopefully this is giving you um, an idea of how you can organize your week. Um, I used to do... Um, I used to do... Um, social media planning like I mean I used to do videos every day but I just don't have time to do it every day now since um, I'm just doing a lot in my schedule so I'm gonna just bring this down a little bit so you can see what I'm writing so now I'm going to begin to write um, in each day so this is passion planner Monday okay and then this is um, this is worship Wednesday okay and then this is free Friday so people don't know that's what I, I like name my days like people don't know that I do this but it really keeps me organized as I like can know exactly what I upload I don't have to spend a lot of time thinking about like what I'm going to upload and then this is live set um success Saturday and then on my days that I am just taking notes, I want to use black because this is going to be my batch day. I batch on Sundays. I batch videos. And for those of you who don't know what batching is, is when you film all of your videos in one day. Um, sometimes I get to do this, y'all. And to be honest, life hits you. And just sometimes I just don't get to batch. But my goal is always to batch at least three videos, at least Passion Planner Mondays, at least um, Worship Wednesday, and here, I'm not going to call it Worship Wednesday, I want to say, like, I want to do my planners and BJ for Bible journaling, right? And then on Friday, is Free Friday, I usually do, like, a haul or another planner video and then I have to plan my content for success Saturday so those are basically like the four videos and then I have to do my plans for a replay Sunday so I'm going to replay on Sunday so those are one two three four five those are the five things that I'm going to be Batching, at least <laughs> I'm planning to batch. You know, sometimes it doesn't happen that way. Sometimes if I can just get that passion plan on Monday in there, like I'm golden, right? This is Tuesday, this is Wednesday, this is Friday, and this is... Oh, wait, I messed up. This is not Tuesday, this is Wednesday. Oh, shoot. Now I gotta get some white out, Joe. Because this is not every day. This is every other day. All right. Let me try this again, y'all. <laughs> All right. This is Wednesday. Worship Wednesday. This is Free Friday. And this is Saturday. This is Saturday. And this is Sunday. Okay. All right, so that is my batching schedule. And then here is Success Saturday. So, of course, um, this Saturday coming up is our last Saturday that I'm doing in a series called Organization. So, if you have not seen that series that I'm doing about organization, come on over a Saturday. I am there at 930 
a.m. and it goes to 10.30 a.m. And this Saturday, I don't do it often, but this Saturday I'm doing a giveaway, y'all. So usually I don't tell people I'm doing a video giveaway beforehand, but since I'm doing this video, I'm letting you know I am doing a giveaway. Um, and then here on Free Friday, um, I, I may do a Dollar Tree haul. Um, so, yeah, it'll probably be a Dollar Tree haul. I may even do the Dollar Tree haul live. Like, I don't know. Um, but I haven't gone shopping yet, so I have to film that video later um, in the week. So, if I'm doing a live, of course, I'm, I can't batch it because it's not pre-recorded. I will have to do it the day of. So, I may do that live Friday. Um, this is a, a planner sheet. So, this will probably be like my data or some um, something I learned on YouTube. Um, same thing here. So, I could just write data and learning as the title for that one um i don't know why i'm going backwards but anyway uh, for passion planner mondays what i want to focus on are the back pages um i probably won't get to do that until next monday though i'll probably focus on the back pages for February so yeah I want to change this I'll I'll just start with the back pages February because I basically just started back with passion plan on Mondays so I'm just going to do um, my weekly layout I'll do my weekly layout this week and then um, next week I'll do the back pages so let me put that down here as a note that this is going to be back pages because people don't know Happy Planner has pages in the back that hardly nobody, you know, use, uses. And then on Tuesday, this is another data and learning page. I, well, I'm not really using. I'm not doing a video this day, but I want to be using this to take notes. Um, maybe I can take notes here and here. I can. Um, I can talk about also. Um, um, YouTube channels because I like to watch other people YouTube channels and I also like to um, you know be in in the community and join other people's YouTube channels so I at least once a week at least once a week more than that usually I use sub somebody else's channel just to be like sociable or um, I can also put right here, like when my friends, when I have other friends who are creators, I can also put right here when their channels come on, especially when they come on live, so I won't miss a beat with that, okay? So basically, that is how I'm going to be using this. Um, I have tried to do social media planners, like for a long time. I've went through trial and error. I used to use like... The happy planner half sheets i used to use a tn now i'm using rings and so far i really like the rings idea um but we'll see if this lasts because i don't know but um i'm pretty happy and excited about how this turned out let me know in the comments if you like this idea if you like um the way i set everything up because i would love to hear from you and of course as always thank you so much planner friends for your support i will see you in the next video stay safe stay healthy wear your mask and i'll see you again my friends all right thank you so much for watching talk to you later bye